debut is, uh, well, an interesting story, maybe the possibly the best ever headline that we might get on GB News. Maybe it's going to put us out of business. What do you, what do you say? It's basically written for GB News. So, Suella Braverman has declared war on woke witch trials. She's the Attorney General. So she's scrapped uh, these, these diversity training schemes, which she says are downright dangerous with the, the content. And they're also sucking up a huge amount of time. So uh, her officials in her department uh, took part in almost 2,000 hours of diversity training, which is insane. I mean, it's, it's, it's a grift. It's a sort of self-sustaining grift for activist, activist trainers who say, oh, you know, Britain's systemically racist and misogynist and homophobic, so we've got to have all this training to, to ameliorate it. But, you know, obviously there's no way of sort of really proving either way. So, uh, so they're getting lots of, lots of money. Stonewall, uh, you know, shake companies down for, for money so they can, they can get their, uh, be, you know, part of the scheme. And it's a chore for staff. I mean, we've, we've all had real jobs and you, you've got to give up an afternoon when you could be doing your work. I mean, there is free sandwiches, but it's still, you know, you're getting nagged. And, uh, and also, you know, you've got to walk on eggshells all the time with all, all this stuff, you know, getting taught about uh, microaggressions. Like a friend of mine uh, had training today, uh, was telling me about it. And uh, they, they were being taught, uh, taught that if you excluded somebody from a project, you know, for perfectly legitimate reasons, like their skills weren't needed, you had to explain to them that it wasn't because uh, they're different. It's not because they're a different ethnicity or anything like that. Is that why you uh, sort of took me aside and said that was why you didn't want me to hang out with you and Nick? You're, you're right here. You're running the show. It's <laughs> well, the opposite of that. He's um, controlling the media. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the, all, this, all this diversity, all this equality, diversity and inclusion stuff is just it's a huge drag on the economy. And it doesn't do anything useful. So it's good to see government ministers recognising this and doing something about it. Well, look, I hesitate to ask, Nick, but do you think there is any benefit at all to these schemes? Absolutely not, Josh. Although, <laughs> I mean, Leo said we've all done proper jobs. I haven't really, but I imagine... No, I've done the odd one. But um, I love that what Bradman said here. She said, like the witch finder general... Uh, finders of, sorry, like the witch finders of the Middle Ages, they don the outfit of the Inquisitor and never tire of rooting out unbelievers. She's absolutely right. This is why I backed her to win. She lost, but this is why she's good. Because these courses... These sort of causes that tell you, oh, you're inherently evil for being white. They are racist. Yeah. The worst that most people say about them is that they're divisive. If yeah. you attack any other race, it's racist. If you attack white people, we go, it's divisive. Mm. But I just, just call it racist, is what it is. Yeah. And what's happening now, quite humorously, is that um, people are now suing for these courses, not just white people, but there was a Latino uh, woman the other day at Sky, and they said to her, oh, you must be oppressed because you're Latino. Mm. Some white woman said that to her. So she said, no, and I find that offensive. Sued them, got 14 grand. <laughs> oh, so, my God. So that you... Please, please, GB News, get in some Jewish diversity. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make some money. Exactly. Okay. So they're, they're offensive to everyone, and, and that's what I was going to say. And also, it, it reminds me of that Tavistock thing, you know, the woke civil service stopping policies going through. So it's, yeah. a, it's a good move to end this stuff. Okay, great.